Craig, when when the um, when you heard that the city council was going to close the Edmonton City Centre Airport, what did you think? Well, we had given a, a documentation bef during the hearing process uh, in front of council saying that uh, we had great concern uh, about closing the Muni from a medic medevac experience. <clears throat> it's very, uh, you know, we use it a lot. Uh, planes come in, pick up our patients, and quickly bring them to uh, to uh, Edmonton. And so it's, we have great concern that the immunity being closed is going to impact us medically. It impacts us uh, medically and getting the patients from Coal Lake Hospital quickly into Edmonton for you know emergency surgery. Surgery. It's a big issue uh, here in Coal Lake and surrounding area, but also for our flying club here in Coal Lake. They they want to fly from the uh, airport here and into the Muni and uh, be able to do business. Uh, this is the big impact is we have a lot of uh, people that fly into Edmonton and they just want to go in to Edmonton for for a quick meeting and fly out. Do you have any uh, personal experiences with the success of the medevac service? Do you know anybody that's been successfully? Well, the issue I I for us uh, medically is that, of course, minutes saves lives. And, uh, you know, we've had a lot of patients that are critically uh, injured, um, especially with the oil, pa uh, oil sands operation being here. And it's a big recreation area uh, that we... Uh, we're too far for STARS Air Rescue to come in uh, and, and fly from from uh, Edmonton into Coal Lake. So a lot of patients get air medevac. So a lot of heart attack patients and uh, critically injured get flown. And right now they, uh, they fly out of uh, the Four Wing uh, Airport here on in Coal Lake and they fly directly into the Muni Airport. You know, by closing the Muni, it's going to impact us now. They say that uh, the patient uh, load is going to go to the International Airport, but uh, the distance from the International Airport to uh, downtown Edmonton, where the hospitals are, is, is quite a quite a big distance, and it's gonna it's gonna delay uh, medical treatment, which is huge. Do you have any any message that you would like to pass on to, to the people of Edmonton? Well, from the people of Edmonton, you know, it, you know, it's, you're not gonna ever rebuild this. I mean, to give up an asset like the the Muni Airport downtown Edmonton is huge, and uh, yeah, it'd be nice to be able to do uh, high residential. Uh, living in, in the inner city, but uh, boy, you're never going to get this airport back, and who knows what the future is going to be in terms of transportation. You may, uh, things may be different 50 and 100 years from now, and uh, that piece of real estate is so vital for uh, future generations.